In less than five minutes, you and I are going to build a prediction model together using only a few mouse clicks and no code. Our use case is to predict whether a patient will be a no-show for a medical appointment. This type of binary prediction is something the Salesforce Einstein Prediction Builder tool is perfect for. Just point, click, and predict based on your historical Salesforce data. First, we will access a scratch org that has everything we need. Then we'll build the prediction model together and we'll even add the prediction score back to the records in Salesforce. Your scratch org will be created once you visit the URL in this page. This URL and others can be found in the comments below. Be sure to make note of your username and password in case you want to log back into your sandbox in the next 30 days. Once your org is provisioned, click on the button labeled Launch via Credentials. You can click on the Get Started button for the Einstein Prediction Builder or search for the Prediction Builder setup. Once you click on the Get Started button, you will see a message indicating Prediction Builder is being set up for you. Once Prediction Builder is set up, just click the New Prediction button to start creating your first prediction model. Enter the prediction name, My No Show Prediction, and hit the Tab key. Once you hit the Tab key, Salesforce will automatically generate the API name. Click Next on the bottom right of the screen. Select the object called Medical Appointment and leave the No Segment radio button checked. You can click the Check Data button to confirm that you have at least 400 records, and then click Next in the bottom right corner of the screen. Because our prediction is a binary one, we select the Yes-No box on the left. When you see the top right corner of the box is blue, you know the box has been selected. Click Next. The scratch org comes already prepared with the field you need, so check the field box on the left and the next button on the bottom right corner. The field we want to predict is a check, check box called No Show, which you will want to select. You'll want to select the records for the field Appointment Day that is less than or equal to the date time of 5 26 2016 12 a.m. You can click the Check Data button to get info from the data checker and then click Next in the bottom right corner of the screen. Next, you'll want to select the fields Einstein will use for the prediction model. Listed at the top of the screen is the 11 fields that I chose. Click Next in the bottom right corner when you're done. Now we'll ask Salesforce to create a field for us in the Medical Appointment Custom Object. I titled the field No Show Likelihood. Again, you can use the tab key to have Salesforce automatically create the field name. Make sure the Show Top Predictors in Records is on, and then click Next in the bottom right corner. If everything looks good, you can click Build Prediction. And then you can, and now that you've done your part, it's time for Einstein to go to work and build your prediction model. Go ahead and click the Done button. You'll see that your scorecard is not available yet. It will probably take about 10 to 15 minutes, although it could take a bit longer for Einstein to finish up. Refresh your screen, and when you see the status is ready for review, you can click on the drop-down menu on the right and select View Scorecard. On the overview page, you can see that the prediction quality of our model is good and that the top predictors are within 24 hours, previous no-shows, neighborhood, and the age bracket of 15 to 24 years old. You can click on the details page for more information. Don't worry if your prediction model comes up with slightly different results than mine. Once you are satisfied with your model, you can select Enable, which will result in the prediction model being deployed. Einstein will then start predicting or scoring the records that were not used for the prediction model. If you want to see how the prediction model you built is deployed, you can use the Object Manager in Setup to add the new field you created called No Show Likelihood to the page layout. Then you can use the App Launcher to select the Medical Appointment object, which is where you will add the column to the list view. From the list view, choose the Select Fields to Deploy option. Then add the No Show Likelihood field to the visible fields. Don't forget to click on the Save button. 
With that, you'll see scores appear in the new column in the list view and in the individual record pages if you added the new field to the page layout. And that's it. We've used Salesforce Prediction Builder to build a prediction model with Einstein doing the rest. Any questions? Reach out to me on LinkedIn or Twitter. Thank you.